What's up guys? Ashley Bornanson here with the Red Carpet Report. We're here in Beverly Hills at the 17th Annual PRISM Awards. What are the PRISM Awards? They honor real life depictions of mental illness and substance abuse in television and film. Of course. Hi Wendell, how you doing? I'm good, how are you? Good. You resonate this aura that is electrifying. Well, thank you very much. <laughs> You're welcome. Well, I'm very thankful for that. I, I'd much rather you be happy to see me than not. So thank you so much. That's very Ah, oh, there's Wendell coming down the carpet. <laughs> Here he comes again. <laughs> oh my God! Well, thank you for that. Uh, that means a lot. So, Wendell, tell me what brought you out here tonight. Well, I think this is just a wonderful. I, I don't know how to even put it. It's awards, but you know, it's what they're honoring. You know, as actors, we try to portray things as honestly as possible, and you want to affect people. And you know, they're they're dealing with addiction and Alzheimer's, and that's what they're honoring. Who portrays that in such a positive manner? You know, to where it can reach the audiences watching. So, to be a part of something like that is just amazing. I support supporting people who are doing it well. You know, that's an honor in itself. And I think it's so important because as actors, that's what we want to do. We want to bring a story to life so that it may affect the audience. Hopefully someone who's going through that will see that and want to change that or want to fix that or maybe it'll t it'll take a show, you know, portraying that for them to go, wait a minute, I need to change this and work this out and, and get better for myself. You know what I mean? So to, to be here on this carpet and, and be at the PRISM Awards where they're honoring that, I couldn't say no. That's great. So have there been issues that yourself, you've tackled as an, as an actor that a lot of viewers have been like, hey Wendell, Thank you so much for covering this. Thank you for representing me. Oh, yeah. Well, you know, Body of Proof, um, and that was in season two, you know, we dealt with the whole body image thing. Me being a big man, you know what I mean? Now, now it's work for me, you know what I mean? So I get praise for who I am, and I'm very happy in that. But to have Curtis deal with that and, and just the stress of not being good enough, not feeling good enough, and it was more than body issue. It was just about this pressure that we put on ourselves. I tell people all the time, when I make a mistake or when I, I do something that I'm not proud of, there's no one in this world who's harder on me than me. Exactly. We're our worst critics. <laughs> we are our worst critics. Exactly. And I, I tell people all the time, I wrestle with myself so much of trying to do good and be good and all of this. So to pr we portrayed that in Body of Proof, and it was nice to kind of, I had to face that in myself. I had to go to those dark places of of that insecurity and when those moments are to pull from that and so it was nice to be able to pull from that put it on screen and then before it even got to air the crew came to me and said the scene there's a scene where i'm sitting in there and i want to eat the cake and i'm fighting it and i'm struggling the scene said you don't know how much that connected with me just in shooting it you know and it was the same response when it was on the air and so that's what at least that's what i want to do i speak healing process it is a healing yeah. process and I, and I speak for us as actors, yeah. but I know for myself, that is the main goal. Like, all of this is fun, but it's affecting people. Changing lives and touching lives, that's why I do what I do. So it was nice to be able to do that on the show. Of course. Thank you so much. Thanks for addressing those issues and making it real. Oh, and nice. congrats on the show and have fun tonight, okay? Oh, thank you so You're much. Welcome. Such a pleasure to meet y'all. Of course. You too. Wow, wasn't that inspiring? It's nice to see Hollywood taking on these big issues. If you like this video, be sure to like it, and for more interviews, subscribe. Have a good night.